Hello, in this demonstration, I'm going to show you how to connect Clover to Cosmos Sync for your e-commerce integration. After you've gotten your free trial, you will notice a message you have not created any actions yet. Actions are used to create products, inventory sync, and orders. Click on Create Action, choose Clover, add a different account. If you have multiple locations, give it a name, Portland, Clover. Choose your location, in this case, Portland Async. Now when you click Clover, you will see Portland Clover is connected. Click Continue, and choose your next connections. I'm going to choose Shopify. Add account. Give your store name. Hit Next. Go back to Shopify and you'll see your account is connected. Click continue. Click call over and your location. Now at this point you'll need to add your action for the operations you want to achieve. I'm going to do send standard products. Clover Portland. Give it a name. Hit save. Let's do the same for inventory. Inventory levels for standard. Give it a name. Now you will need to configure actions to let eSync know the criteria. With Clover, you only need to give a date. So we target on a timestamp for your products when they were updated. If your product has changed your point of sale or you've newly imported products, they will have a new timestamp and we'll target only those products. Hit save, go back, configure your other actions, and if you have any questions, just follow the question marks and they will tell you what to do. Go back one day, hit save. Now we need to locate our location ID. Go to this URL at your shopping cart. CosmosCSync.com, my Shopify, and our Portland store apparently is this location. Location, hit save. Now, if you want to review your settings, just click configure again and you'll see that they have been saved. Now to use your actions, you need to add them into a task. Just add one action per task. To create products, we're going to send standard. Hit save. We'll also do the same for inventory. Hit save. Now you, if we log into Clover, change the price to 17. 99, give it a new timestamp. And let's run Clover Portland to create products into our Shopify. Click products and say scarf right here. Price $17.99. You will also notice that inventory is at zero. We're going to have to run our inventory action next. Set run. Now, if we hit refresh in Shopify, you'll see a Portland warehouse has 202 in stock. We change the quantity, hit save, let's run again.
pointing out is 250. If you have any questions, please contact us at CosmoCentral.com and start your free trial today. Thank you.